Hello again everybody. Um, here's another update on the charger. Um, right now I've got this running into this battery pack which I have uh, 5 cells, 1.2 volts, so it's a 12 volt pack. Um, I've got it running into a capacitor right here, um, which is just a uh, 230 volt by 1000 U ferret. And uh, I got it running into a little DC motor right there. And it's just coming into the same same parts that I told you guys before right here and right here. And um, it's coming right into that, into my pump. And right now, this is at 12 and a half volts. Um, it's all right. So anyways, I'm going to start it up. See, it's at like 10.7, 10.8 that battery's at. I mean, it's fluctuating back and forth. But here I'm going to plug it in and we'll start doing everything so you guys can see it all. Alright, so it's running. We're still at, it dropped down just a little bit. We're already at 11 sis because it already started charging and initiated the charge already. Alright, so I'm going to bring this over here. Okay, and as you can tell it's still doing its thing, fluctuating back and forth. We'll let it get up to where it starts holding the charge. Okay. Is this going to jump back and forth for a little bit? Okay. And I also wanted to do this. Um, as you can tell, it's doing its thing. I'm going to take this out, okay, I'm going to throw it on amperage, okay, and this is what I want you all to see, okay, this is what's going into the pump right here, 1.6, 1.8, somewhere around there, alright, and I'm going to come over here, and this is what's going into this part, Alright, that's that part before it gets transferred over to DC. Alright, and now let's come over to the DC part where it's charging. Right here. Oh, sorry, sunlight. 0.27 of an amp. I thought you weren't supposed to get more than you put in. But anyways, there's that one, here's this one. So, I'm going to hook this back up so you guys can see this on voltage. See where the battery's at. Alright, it's at 12.7. So, also, I'm going to go like this and hook this, this up. Now, watch. It'll charge right back up. I mean, and there's some. I'm pushing hard. As you can tell, I just burnt myself. I'll do it again. And she'll just keep charging. See? Still charging with the motor running. It'll go up again, watch. It'll charge all the way up to 13.6, I believe. 13.9, right around there. With the motor running. It'll go up again. I hope you guys get the idea of what I'm trying to get here to you. I mean, if there's people out there that can spend a little bit of money on doing what they need to do here,
Once it goes up one more, I'll go ahead and show you the amperage that's going into everything. Just give me a few minutes. See, still going up. Still doing a charge with the motor running. Alright. So we'll let that run and I'll show you the amperage again of everything that's going on. Alright, so I'm just going to pull this off. We'll let this continue running. Alright. And then we'll go back to amperage. Alright. Let's see what we got going into this. But it's running nice and smooth. And then we also got that one. So we're still getting 0.25 of an amp charging the battery. We'll come back over here. This is what's coming into the pump or into the TV. Half an amp. And then this is what's going into the motor. One seventeen of an amp. I don't know. Come on, all you Einsteins out there, what's going on here? And there's our voltage to our battery, which really hasn't depleted at all. And I'll come back over here one more time, just so you guys can see. Let's see what the battery is at now. That's all I have is the battery charged in. Motor's still running. Still at 12.7. Let's see how long it takes to get to 12.8. Because I know it will. <laughs> Sorry for all the shaking. <laughs> there it goes, still charging. With the motor running. She's fighting. She's fighting to go back up. But as you can tell, she's slowly stabilizing the 12.8. Alright. Now it's just going to take a little while to get 12.9, but I don't think you guys want to sit here and watch all that. You guys get the idea. 10 minutes of your life already. But anyway, so I got another DC pump running with a battery charging. And I'm running a lot less amperage going into my pump than what I am putting into my batteries. So, um, anyways, I hope you all enjoy. You guys get the idea here. Now, the only thing that really kind of stinks is whenever you're doing this, it kind of sucks a lot of the energy out of here. So the bulbs that you, you tap in are a little dimmer. But the overall, you still get lighting out of it while it's charging. But So we got motors running. And we got a battery charging. Um, let me know what y'all think. Have a great one. God bless everyone.